Being productive in tech sales is essential for achieving success in a competitive industry. Here are some strategies to boost your productivity in tech sales. Set clear goals, define specific, measurable, and achievable sales goals. Having clear objectives will help you stay focused and motivated and prioritize tasks. Identify your most important tasks each day and prioritize them. The 80-20 rule, the Pareto principle, also applies in sales where 20% of your efforts result in 80% of your results. Time management. Effectively manage your time by using techniques like time blocking, where you allocate specific blocks of times to particular tasks. Eliminate distractions during these periods, super crucial and prospect effectively. If you focus on high potential leads by figuring out your ideal candidates and using CRMs to be organized. If you develop a process, it'll help you guide you to many stages from initial contact to closing. This will help you stay organized and help you stay focused. Continuous learning. You have to stay on top of industry trends and product knowledge and sales techniques. Attend a lot of conferences, read a ton of books, take courses, always improve. And you have to build your personal brand. When you establish yourself as an authority in your niche by sharing knowledge to social media, blogs, speaking engagements, it'll help you attract more leads and you have to leverage technology. Nowadays, there's so many tools, CRMs, email automation, analytics and productivity apps that will help you just be a lot more focused. And when you have a strong template and a cadence, it'll help you save time instead of trying to reinvent the wheel every single time. Make sure you have effective communication, being able to communicate clearly and succinctly, being able to leverage all these different tools to be able to connect and engage with customers. Next, you have to qualify leads. So what you have to do is you have to be able to ask questions, make sure it's worth your time so you're not wasting any time and see which ones are more likely to convert and make sure you network. Networking is so crucial. There's so many people out there, join associations, connect with colleagues and be able to have an ecosystem that helps you be able to get leads. Being able to, to be smart with your time is important. So analyzing different data and figuring out which strategies is the best for you. And you always have to evaluate and adjust accordingly to get feedback from your manager, from your peers, your mentors, so that you could refine your techniques and strategies and get better over time. Next, make sure you focus on building your interpersonal skills, your emotional intelligence. This will help you be able to understand customer needs, your sales approach accordingly. Practicing resilience will help as well. If you develop resilience, you'll be able to have a positive attitude when things aren't going your way and make sure you take care of your well-being. This is so crucial. Exercise, getting enough sleep, managing stress, will help you be more productive. Collaboration is important. Sharing best practices, make sure you're adding value to your colleagues as well. So many of us focus on the outside, but the internal ecosystem is equally just as important. Make sure you regularly optimize and reflect on what's working and what's not working. Stay blessed, my friends.